blowing like nearly 80 knots here yes everybody sit down otherwise you're going to get blown off seems to be okay now see what signs can come off Yeah, it's all good now. We're at 22,000 feet exactly as well. So, brilliant. We've got 84 miles to go to our next one. The view is just gorgeous clouds. And it's snowy down there. So, man, I'm... Uh, let's have a look at the station, actually. Let's have a look at the weather. What's weather we got at uh, Narita. Uh, we've got some surface winds, 10 knots, blowing 6-0. Cloudy. Uh... Clouds down to few at 3,000 and broken at 6,000. So it should be an interesting landing, to be honest. We'll see. Anyway, I'll see you when we're closer on the descent. BCC 2003, establish and maintain a heading of 230 to Sierra Delta Echo MS file. Heading 230 for Sierra Delta Echo. Continue on navigation. B. Right, so I've brought us back a little bit early. Um, we are about 80 miles off the top of the descent, but I thought I'd bring us back um, so we could go through the procedure um, of our descent. So. 
Um, everyone's satisfied. We're going to give them a cup of coffee before we go down. Um, in fact, we're going to tell them probably to sit down now because it's beginning to be a bit bumpy. As we can see here, it's a bit rock and rolly, so... Right, so in order for us to... Whoa. Yeah, the plane's really jerking here. Um, right, let's have a look at our uh, arrival information. First off, let's look at the weather. Ladies and gentlemen, from the cockpit once again, just to let you know, we're expecting a small amount of turbulence up ahead. And as such, I've turned on the seatbelt sign. For your safety, please remain seated for a few moments until the lights turn back off. Thank you. Yeah, man, it's, it's really windy right here at the moment. Right, so at the moment the uh, Narita is raining, um, pressure is 1015, let me write that down, um, at the moment. Um, surface wind is 9 knots, blowing 050, and it's 9 degrees, so it's, it's, it's not too bad, temperature wise. Uh, there's light rain happening at the moment, and we got clouds between three and five thousand feet so that's going to be a very interesting landing um so yeah our top of descent is in about 60 nautical miles so we're going to quickly review the um charts we've got 34 miles to go until we actually hit our next waypoint and it's hard to get the thing here with the sh I was say the ship, the plane rocking and rolling. Right, so uh, our um, approach here, uh, we need a course of 1.5 set for the localizer. Final approach course is 157 with a uh, procedure altitude of 4,000 feet. So basically, we need to be at 4,000 feet here to come in. Elevation uh, issues, by the looks of it, 4,000 feet. So as long as we are above 4,000 feet we are fine um, we don't really have an arrival uh, assigned to us because we're VOR um, and it's literally going to be a straight in from from this uh, 117 uh, point which is our final VOR 117.0 and then we tune BC, in for the airport zero, zero, three. So. Establish and maintain a heading of 240 Delta Echo in this file. Heading 240 for Sierra Delta Echo. Continue on navigation BCC0003. Right, 28. Oh, it always does this, you know. Every time they call me, and I think my first officer, I think he changes the, uh, the navigation. Because it always changes the heading of the plane. Let me. Uh, I, I haven't selected nav there. So he shouldn't be playing with it, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We're really windy here. We're rocking and rolling. Um, right, coming up on our uh, next VOR point. Where are we? Yeah, 24 miles, and then after that, it's probably another 40 miles to go. Um, it's been really gorgeous. Look at that. I mean, look at that. Bloody hell. Uh, let's get the alcohol flow into the uh, guests because we want to get 100%. Uh, Vatsim. <coughs> Vatsim is... <laughs> excuse me. There is, there is people in the air, but there are uh, below us. So... <coughs> excuse me. Um, by the time we get to, there's only one lad, Alex, by the time we get to Narita, he'll be out of here. He's, um, in fact, he's going to the airport in front of us, so he'll be landed by the time we even pass him. Other than that, nobody else is really in our way. Everyone else is going into Haninda. There's one person who's coming into, um, whoa, what the hell? One person who's coming into um, our airport. So 
so we probably will have to ditch Pro ATC at the very last minute and go um, on I think I'm going to set that now in case that is the case one one two actually it's no point setting this because he'll uh, he'll alter it won't he that'll change when he um Yeah, right. Let's go through our uh, descent and approach checklist. We need to start the APU up. So, um, air delivery valve open. APU starts. Oh dear! I can't press it. Windy. Right, APU has started. I believe. Check the APU has started. No, it hasn't. We haven't started the APU yet. I can't press it. Everything's moving. There, APU has started. Check. No smoking signs on. Uh, Seatbelt signs on already. Check. <clears throat> I'm going to announce uh, that we'll be doing our descent soon. In fact, I'm going to tune in our final heading. And then swap over the VOR. And then retune that heading. We're 70 miles away from top of descent. So. Uh, booster pumps all on. Let's, might as well shove them on now. Booster pumps are on. Um, actually, we just turned them off, sorry. They were already on. I didn't realise that. Anyway, let's put them back on. That was my bad. I forgot to, forgot to turn them off in cruise. Whoops. Fuel check. Uh, pretty much drained in the middle. Wing tanks only. Speed brakes zeroed. I don't even know where the speed brake lever is. Wait, was I moving? Oh, okay, we do have speed brakes. Um, right, that's basically it. Uh, landing speed is going to be 176 knots. Which is pretty fast, to be fair. Uh, but then the, we've got, like, crosswinds and all sorts going on with us, so... Right. He's going into land. B, C, C, 2, zero, zero, 3. Clear to intersection Hotel Echo Romeo Oscar November. Turn to heading 245. Clear to Hotel Echo Romeo Oscar November. Intersection heading 245 BCC2003. Alright, always keep changing me. Bit of Japan down there. I guess this is not the snowy territory here. Bits here that aren't snowy. Wow, look at that. Beautiful, eh? Absolutely beautiful. There's a dude, I think, coming in to land at this airport. Look at that. Oh, honestly. Look at that. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Guys, you're looking at default, except for some Asia land class. That's basically it. Just Asia land class. Um, and it's default textures down there. I've got to say, that's enough. That That is sorted for, for Japan. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. In. And sink back up here with our seems to be a little bit off. Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Oh. 
Right, basically that's it. Uh, we've got 50 miles to go, so um, we're going to, we've already seated them, so they're waiting patiently. Let's give them one round, last round of drinks, and then we'll uh, start our descent Ladies checklist. And gentlemen, we are about to start serving alcoholic drinks. Please make sure your tray table is in the down position and clear any items from the out. Thank you. Cross valve is closed. We're not using that center tank anymore. Uh, we'll actually leave that open to drain off the last bits of it in the day. Right, uh, that's basically it. APU is running. Yep. Beautiful. Right, let's, uh, announce we're going down. Ladies and gentlemen from the cockpit, once again, you'll be delighted to know that we will shortly be starting our descent, at which point the cabin crew will start preparing for our arrival. If you can make sure all aisles are clear for the cabin crew as they start making their way around the aircraft, it will be most appreciated. Thank you. Uh, snowy peaks again over here. Right. We are ready for descending. Uh, 45 miles to go and we'll be descending down. Lovely jabbly. We might as well go through a descent checklist. Descent checklist. FMC. We haven't got an FMC, Check. mate. ICAS. We haven't got an ICAS. Check. Be rack speed. Well, Check. I don't think we've done that. Yep. Have we gone? As required. Anti-ice is still on, mate. Passenger signs are on. Checklist complete. Beautiful. Right, waiting for the landing. I shall bring us back in 40 miles time. Right, we've just uh, asked for a descent. So we are going to do that. So first thing we have to do is put our throttles back, but for some reason I can't do that because I don't know what's going on there. So I'm going to try and manually. Nope. I'm going to try turning the autopilot off. Nope. Oh dear, we've got a problem. We can't reduce our throttles. Uh, let me just take the controls. Nope. Seriously, I don't know what to say. Right, we're going to be going down, so... Start a uh, thousand. Now this is the problem. If I can't reduce me throttles, how am I supposed to maintain me speed? I mean... Climbing to flight level two three zero. Vanilla nine or one seven. BCC two zero zero three. Heading correction two three zero five. Is it an FSY PC? Heading three zero five. Fox truck helo echo. Continue on navigation. BCC two zero zero three. No, I don't, honestly, I, I don't know what's going on. And where is my plane turning? Do you know what? This flight's becoming a little bit of a shit show. <laughs> I'm not in cinematographer mode like last time. Descending of 12000, UNH1013, BCC2003. What did he say? Descending to what? I missed that. Say again, BCC2003. Descend to 12000. Descend to 12000, QNH1003, can't even I can't even bring them back. But they're at 67%, so they're retarding themselves. Oh, I don't know, mate. It's rocking and rolling, huh? 
Are we turning again? I'm turning with plane ATC. The same remote control ATC, mate. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. But, oh, for fuck's sake. Let's set these suckers to relight. Uh, air delivery open, check. Air cross feed, check. Set these to the APU. Check. Um, start switches are on relay. Auxiliary one goes on. Check. Um, and then gear down. We're going to 12,000. We're going to go back again. In the Rocking and rolling time, isn't it? Fuck's sake. We're all gonna die. If I can't control me throttles, we're all gonna die. Do you know what? I was able to push them up. I was able to send them full throttle, but it just it's getting them back off that now, isn't it? Don't know. 71 miles until the next beacon. And then we're on an air approach, which is going to have to be a visual. Because I can't. I don't have any navigational equipment but VOR. And unfortunately, there is no other VOR uh, beacon for us. So. You have a look at the charts. Um. Yeah, it's just the runway heading after that. After 117, we tune in for the runway heading. So, yeah, Jesus Christ. Rocking and rolling, this is. Severe turbulence, you telling me, mate? 67 miles to go. We need to get down to 12,000 feet. Bloody hell. What does it look like from the outside? Oh, yeah. Look at that plane, man. Twizzling like a... <laughs> Honestly, what is going on here? They don't fly like they're on rails anymore, do they? Keep heading. Right, so it looks like we've got a arrival um, other than us. But he must have already landed because it doesn't actually say where he's coming from. Mika, his name is, but I can't, I can't see him. Yeah, nobody. So he must have already landed. Tokyo Center two two zero seven. With your plastic flight level two seven zero for flight level three two zero two two zero seven. Roger, climb to flight level three two zero. Climbing flight level three two zero two two zero seven. Right, 14,000 feet coming down. 2207, descent to flight level 220. Descent to flight level 220. I'm going to put two, a stage two, of flaps zero. out. Oh, nope, no, nope, no, nope, no, nope. flaps up. Okay. Check. Right, he's reset my transition altitude. Is, is it set correct though? That's the, good, that's the thing. One one zero one six, so it's not really. There we go. Three thousand. Yeah. Okay, that's done. Uh, we do need to kind of. I, know, I, I really don't know. How many throttles are going to work? Right, we're at twelve thousand feet. 
Oh, he's actually, he said he's allowed me to go down even further, sorry. So we can actually put that down to 1,000 still. We're going down further, folks. Approach. Still haven't got me throttles. But they are going backwards, look at that. They're recharging automatically. He must be doing this. He must be the, the autobot. ILS is approach. Runway one six right. Yep. CC zero zero three. Yep, we got that. Bloody ripper rony rever this is. Bad weather ahead, folks. Hello, this gentlemen, this is your captain. We're all gonna die. <laughs> Oh yeah, baby. Coming into the cloud layer now. Why hasn't he announced that one? I've a bit of a delay with these announcements. Ladies and gentlemen, from the cockpit once again. I want to let you know we look like we're about to encounter some rough weather up ahead, so I've turned on the seatbelt signs. Uh, we'll do our best to keep any disturbances to a minimum, but for your safety, please make sure you remain seated with your belt fastened for the next 10 minutes or so, or until I turn the lights back off. Thank you. 47 miles to go, and then we basically start dialing shit in. Right, let's put in the uh, ILS course. So it's 111.5. 511. So that's the course for the ILS. Um, the heading is. 157 which we won't set just yet actually we can do 157 because um, yeah so we kind of need to do a little bit of a uh, a left turn in order to get perpendicular with it so we're turning that heading there that'll put us on a perpendicular course and so then literally we're waiting for this thing to line up and then we turn in 43 miles to go. Passing 10,000 feet. Passing 10,000 feet, so that's uh, landing lights on. Uh, oh, wrong one. That one. And extend that. Extend, extend. There they are. Beautiful. Here we go, boys and girls, through the clouds! Right, uh, what else checklist have we got here? Um, Recheck. Gear. Yeah, mate, I can't do nothing about it, mate. Um, let me see. Let me try and... Oh, gosh, what? how did we get that bloody... What? Let's go 700 on that. That might help slow us down a bit. And we can have, surely, we can have our first stage of flaps out. What's the, uh, there should be some sort of flaps warning thing here. Here we are. Flaps. Um, 8 degrees, 238, is it? So anything between anything 238, right? Yeah, I think we can go first aid. Flaps so. up, Oh, he's already done it. He's already done it, dude. You're getting a little bit with your, you know, you. I haven't got flaps activated for you, mate. You shouldn't be playing with your flaps. So, 37 miles to go. Just literally waiting now for these two lines here to sort of converge, and then that's when we are passing the runway in the right in the right way. Let's get a bit rock and rolling. Speed up. 
speed's happening way too much. We need to. Uh... Whoa! What's happened here? Who's changed this? Are you fucking with me, settings here, mate? You better stop playing with this. Are you gonna kill us, mate? No, not thirteen thousand. Stop it! It's not a game, mate. Six hundred feet. Come on. I'll have to disable you if you're gonna piss about with this. These are people's lives you're playing with. I'm the captain. Listen to me. I'm Look at me, sure. Look at me, sure. I'm the captain now. I'm the captain. Alright? I set 600. It's because I'm maintaining speed, mate. You do not bloody set things. You listen to me and you do as I say. I'll be speaking to your mother about this, mate. <laughs> right, 6,000 feet. Coming in. It's getting windy, man. It's getting so windy. Dude, we're all gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna crash and kill us all. Honestly. This weather is nuts. Uh, they bought their tickets. They knew what they were getting into. I say, let them crash. 32 miles. Come on, we should be crossing this soon. See if we can. Five seven. There's Japan down there. It's all looking gorgeous. You haven't bloody played with it again, have you? You have as well, dude. I'm, do you know what? I, I don't want to fly with you again, mate. In fact, do you know what? Get the fuck out of me plane. B C T to zero zero. Fire! Three, Jump out that window now! <laughs> to, to zero zero. Honestly, you can't Heading trust zero, these zero, cats. Zero. The Yankee Echo. Continue on right, have I got B control of the trolls? Zero, no, three. I haven't. Right. Ah, oh, who's please changed this? Do you know what? This ain't my plane anymore. I don't, why does this keep getting changed all the time? Put us back on course, mate. Fuck. Seriously, I've got... Oh, fucking hell. Do you know what? I might hand fly this the rest of the way in. Right, we need to go straight to... Uh, S-Y-E. We have a, uh, a direct to S-Y-E. There are no S-Y-E's. There are no... Oh, for God's sakes. <laughs> Mate, this flight is just freaky. I don't know. This plane is not behaving the way. Look, it's back to 1300 again. Why is it doing that? I don't get this at all. Have I got Pro ATC set up to bloody mess with me gauges and shit? Or something. I don't know. Something's triggering something. I had to throw the first officer out the window because he was playing silly buggers too much. 4,000 feet, mate. Dude, we should have passed this by now. I'm turning in because we, we should have passed this by now. Right, turning into the heading of the runway. Let me try and flip this, see if I can trigger it. It should have changed. That should have already changed. We're too low. 4,000 feet is what we're cleared down to. I can see the ground coming up. Someone keeps playing with me bloody pitch numbers. Here we go. We're underneath the clouds now. Confirmed. 157. Right, putting the course. That's why it didn't bloody do it. Because I hadn't even put the course on there. There we go. We've hit it anyway, so... No worries. Right, we should be pretty much lined up with a runway. Let me get either side of this. I mean, it would be helpful if I could do me throttles. I might have to take control of this. Right, we should be lined up with a runway. That is basically direct on. Oh, that's gone down again, hasn't it? Stop fucking about with that. We're going too fast, mate. Right, do you know what? I'm going to have to take control here. Autopilot off. Have I got... I haven't got me throttle still. 
still haven't got me throttle power. So this is going to be fun. Right. I don't know how I'm going to land this without being able to reduce throttles. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Right. Let me... Uh, we're on the heading for the runway. I think we're probably a little off. Right. We're going to put our uh, one light runway lights on now. Girls, uh, seats for landing. Still haven't got me throttles. Right, we're going to have to... Um, oh my god, I don't know what we're going to do here. Another stage of flaps. Still haven't got control of me throttles, and I don't know why. So, we're going to have to use... Right, landing gear down. Throttles are increasing. It's like auto throttle is engaged or something. I, I've never known how you set auto throttle on this thing. I don't even know where the button is to disable it. Where is the auto throttle button? I mean, I've turned the autopilot off, man. Y'all damper, where's that? Nope, still not giving it to me. Right, we're way off course here, we're way off course. Let me get this cat back on course. Now, we're losing speed now. Oh, fuck. Dudes, we ain't gonna make the wrong way. At this rate. Need more power, mate! Where would this auto throttle button be? Then on his side. What's that? Ladies and gentlemen, your captain um, <laughs> can't control the throttles. <laughs> For some reason, I am pulling back and forth on this throttle and it ain't moving jack shit. But it seems to be doing it by itself. It's moving by itself. So, like, it's on auto throttle mode. We're way off course here. We need to get over. BTT to zero zero three heading correction to 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 zero two two zero here Yankee Echo continue on navigation BCC to zero zero three he wants to change me to two two zero now mate we how about a direct to the fucking runway mate never mind you two two zero shit I want to come in to land mate yeah we'll just we'll just forget what he says for now. Oh, we've got to follow ATC, haven't we? We've got to follow what they say. Right, why haven't I got the ability to... Your... Seriously, but this, is, this landing is going to be a disaster. Let me just make sure it's not this. Pull to disable. No, still... No. Ain't that turn and pull stick push pull to disable? That's pulled up, that is, and I've still got control. So, right, um, well, I don't know, I don't know what's, I don't know what's real anymore. Might as well pull the fire handles as well. Hang on, was that the airport? Oh, I thought I saw the airport. Right, we can now turn 157. Turning on the runway. For some reason, I haven't got the ability to yaw. Is that because I put that bloody yaw damper thing on? Let's turn that off. What the fuck? What the hell did I just push? Yaw dampener. 
Why is it not going on? CC to zero, zero, three, turn left, heading. One, four, five. Climb to five. Do you know what? It's not me doing this, mate. I've got a steady hand on these controls. For some reason, this thing here... Ah, uh, off. There we go. There we go. Now I can yaw at myself. If the buddy yaw dampener was on. Right, okay. One, five, seven. Runway should be in sight soon. Get the binoculars out. I'm not seeing it. Too foggy. Right, we all extended. Our wheels have been down for ages, man. What the hell did he just say? Say again, BCC to zero, zero, 003. Please get over. BCC to zero, zero, 003. Turn left, heading 145. Climb to 5000. I'm not climbing to 5,000, mate, when I'm coming back down for landing. I'm coming in for landing, mate. Even Tokyo and down there are saying it. Right. Is that the airport? Where the hell's this airport? Right, we need to get back on this path. BCC to zero, zero, right, three. Captured. Establish and maintain heading off one, one, zero. Heading one, one, zero, BCC to zero, zero, three. Who keeps messing with me BCC fucking BCC dials to here? Zero, zero, it's either three. Pro ATC present or... Present heading I don't know. To approach runway one, six, right, BCC to zero, zero, three. Tower at the marker, mate, isn't it? I wish I could dial these down. Dude, we're gonna be landing at full speed here, right? Next stage of flaps. Oh, we're too money. Too much bloody flaps out. Right, airport somewhere around here, mate. Get on this, uh. Completely blown. Runway should be somewhere. Come on. I right. end up landing in a field. Right, we're ten miles, I think, from the runway. Fourteen hundred feet. We're coming in like a bombshell. We need to get this lined up. What do you see? Oh, we've got rain on us now. Look at that. Look at that. Pretty gorgeous. Right, airport in sight. Not seeing the runway though. Man, where's the puppy lights? Hey, somebody turn the puppy lights on, mate. I'm coming in. There. There's the light. That's got to be it there. Right, we need to get over. Lights confirmed. Toggle these lights. Right. I seriously don't know how we're going to do this, but we're going to give it a go. Right. Next stage of flaps. Man, give me full flaps, mate. Give me full flaps. Right. I hope this throttle plays ball with me. Right. Seriously don't know how we're going to do this, but we might need to use speed brake. Let's pop open the speed brake a little bit. There we go. 
go. It's going to be interesting how to stop on the runway if, the, if I haven't got use of me throttles. You know what I mean? This is the first time this has ever happened where my throttles are not working. And I don't know, man. <laughs> the speed's going down, though. Like, it's a bit weird. Right. It's going to be speed check, man. We are going to hit the end of that runway. Like, tower in the marker. Say again, BCC to 003. On final. BCC to 003, runway 16 right. On final. Bravo, Charlie, Charlie to 003. Slow to final approach. QNH 1013. Clear to land runway 16 right. Reducing the final approach speed. QNH 1013. Clear to land runway 16 right. BCC to 003. Ah, right. It's got to be Pro ATC. Because look. Reducing the final approach speed, and then look at that. The throttles have come right down. Pro ATC must be in charge of my bloody throttles and shit. I must have something wrong in the menu there. Right, well, dude, I need more throttle, mate. Dude, you're going to crash us, mate. Fuck's sake. No speed brake. Flaps up. Oh... Pro ATC, you've killed us all! You bloody bunch of tossers! We haven't made the wrong way! <laughs> NTC call up. Bravo Charlie, Charlie 2, zero, zero, 003. Gaze is right. Contact ground on bomb. Contact ground! Let's follow five. the road, mate. <laughs> Dude, we'll just go travelling on the road instead. On the road again. I just can't wait to get back on this road again. Why is my speed brakes up? The flaps are up. On the road again. I just can't wait to get back on that road again. <laughs> Honestly, I pro ATC have just nuked everybody. By taking control of my landing. That would have been an epic landing. Look, zero feet, not firm enough. They want it harder. <laughs> they love it hard. Oh, dude. I hope this road goes to the bloody um, airport. I hope this is on the way to the airport. I mean, we're out of, we're out of power, mate. We're out of power. Honestly, Pro ATC, I must have something in the uh, the options menu, which we're going to have to stop this, right? Um, there must be something here that says, you know, just kill them in flight, basically. Here we go. Uh, display direction, uh, manual descent initialization, assign approach, insert advanced, I mean. Right, co-pilot support. Contact controllers, confirm instructions. Yes, serve the comm radio. Yes, always serve autopilot. Ooh, maybe turn that one off. Only set autopilot. Yeah, maybe all this shit. Uh, always serve nav radio. No. Uh, only set nav. No. Configure lights. Yeah, you can do that, I suppose. Set flaps and spoilers. No. Set gear. Mm, if I haven't already. Yeah, so that's all. That's basically why. Okay, Pro ATC. If not set up correctly. But how come we still haven't got... Like, I have actually stopped for ATC, and yet I still haven't got control of me throttles. And what's going on with these tiles now? Where have all these tiles come from? Do you know what? I feel like Alice in Wonderland, tumbling down the, the, the rabbit hole. I don't even know where the airport is. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this shit show. <laughs> right. Um, yeah. Welcome to Japan, everybody. I don't know what this black square things have suddenly appeared for, but we're going to limp this pitch to the airport, which is uh, just over the hill here. There's the runway. And um, don't forget uh, to be in with a chance to win 50 euros of sim market vouchers for flight simulator add-ons. All you got to be is a subscriber to my channel and um, 
comment down below in the videos and then at the end of the month one lucky winner gets chosen to win 50 euros in sim market vouchers uh, which i announced during the uh the live vlog on the rate my play away thank you so much for watching guys uh might as well kill them people just thanos them away um yeah <laughs> Take care, everybody, and sayonara.